Lord Jesus, you said that the harvest was plentiful. Help us to see where you are calling us, to speak the words that strike a chord, to show your love to those in desperate need. Let your church be willing to stand up for the powerless and dispossessed, for the voiceless and the marginalised. Let us be the workers at the harvest needs, through your Son, the Lord of the harvest. Amen. Speaking to the people, Jesus said, Take care, protect yourself against the least little bit of greed. Life is not defined by what you have, even when you have a lot. Then he told them a story. The farm of a certain rich man produced a terrific crop, and he said to himself, What can I do? My barn isn't big enough for this harvest. So he said, Here's what I'll do. I'll tear down my barns and build bigger ones. Then I'll gather in all my grain and goods, and I'll say to myself, Self, you've done well. You've got it made and can now retire. Take it easy. Have the time of your life. Just then God showed up and said, Fool, tonight you die. And your barn full of goods. Who gets that then? That's what happens when you fill your barn with self and not with God. The warmth of the sun's embrace, the gentle breeze swept in by incoming tide, 
the rhythm of the seasons of new birth, death and recreation. All these speak so clearly of your love, your power and your beauty. All are expressions of your creativity and more importantly of yourself as an artist might share his personality with each brush stroke. So within the myriad colours of a butterfly's wing, you share the exuberance of your love. That we can glimpse you within creation is a beautiful thought, but also tells us that you desire to be seen, to be found and known. Open our eyes, Lord, as we walk through this world, Feel the wind, the sunshine, see the majesty of creation unfolding before our eyes. Help us to see you. As we celebrate our plenty and give thanks for our food, Father, we praise you for all you have done and for all you have given. For shelves that are laden and cupboards that are full. For food available, varied and affordable. For taste and for flavour. For a healthy appetite and the means to satisfy it. For all that is symbolised in this harvest service. Creator and sustainer of all, we thank and praise you. 
for provider and producer, God and farmer working together in harmony, for all in the food chain from field to factory, retailer to customer, each one depending on the others. Creator and sustainer of all, we thank and praise you. For our countryside, fertile, diverse and beautiful, supplying so much of what we need. Our food, our water, crops for industry, energy and medicine. Source of our leisure, relaxation and renewal. Creator and sustainer of all, we thank and praise you. Amen. Loving Lord, we thank you for your love so freely given to us all. We pray for families around the world. Bless the work of the Mother's Union as we seek to share your love through the encouragement, strengthening and support of marriage and family life. Empowered by your spirit, may we be united in prayer and worship and in love and service Reach out as your hands across the world. In Jesus' name, Amen. God the Father, who created the world, give you grace to be wise stewards of his creation. Amen. God the Son, who redeemed the world, inspire you to go out as labourers into his harvest. Amen. God, the Holy Spirit, whose breath fills the whole of creation, help you to bear his fruits of love, joy and peace. Amen. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. Mm -hmm.